Still recording. Welcome everyone back to Let's Play Skyrim Dawnguard. Okay, so hopefully, hopefully everything will be fine. I don't I see why I don't see why it wouldn't. I don't see why it won't be all right. <clears throat> uh, but it's not. It's hidden the chat. Okay, all right. Yeah, hit chats chats disappeared behind the stuff that we know. Okay, so and my control is in Okay, right. So apart from those two things, everything's fine. Um Um Yeah, okay. So technical issues. <clears throat> fine though, it's fine. Fine. Minor Minor setback. Just have to arrange these some 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 somehow. You hate little, but they're winning the grocery war in Germany. So, um, I, um, yeah, do not like shopping at Little. I would never choose to shop there, but I take my mum shopping and she, she, we go there every week or whatever. Um, but I do not like the, the shop. No, I don't like it. Um, but you can get some pretty nice stuff there. All right, this is fine. Cookies! No, hi. Hmm. Bailey's now. <clears throat> All right, so here we are, back in the Skyrims. Hello, Serena. Um, hello, Grumpus. Should we get him? And he's all mighty vampireness. There he is. We've even got vampire armor on now. <laughs> um, just kind of cause. How you doing, Snow? You doing well? It's good to see you. Um, I think what we'll do as well probably is. Um, kind of finish this and then maybe cure ourselves of vampirism because I don't particularly like being a vampire. I don't think it suits Grumpus, but it um, seemed like a cool thing to do at the time. <laughs> we'll see what it. We'll see what happens anyway. So to summarize, to summarize. Um, um, okay, so uh, Serena and I are trying to look at her mother. Um, uh, Valer Thea, yeah, I think, right? Uh, who may have one of the Elder Scrolls, because we're just searching for Elder Scrolls now. Now we're thinking of portals. I like it, Snow. I like the reference. In uh, Valesia's laboratory, we've re recreated the, an experiment she performed and opened a portal to the Soul Cairn, a plane of oblivion. Serena believes strongly that her mother is inside this strange place and has indicated we should step through. All right, so there we go. And that is what is before us. You ready? Let's go! Oh. <laughs> Geronimo! Get him all! Okay. Smell here. Let's try to handle this quickly. Alright, so it smells, does it? Air around? This is all wrong. You you mind um like telling us how it smells? Because we as the player don't know. Wait, wrong. Okay. I mean, the, it's not very, um, not very, not very descriptive writing, is it? It smells. Okay. Right. And, uh, and it's wrong. Right. Brilliant. Thanks. <laughs> awesome. It's, it smells and it's wrong. And there are ghosts. Or souls, I guess. Having fun? That sky feels like I'm being watched. I like the colour scheme, you know, black and black and purple. It's very cool. We're gonna go in the wrong direction, as is traditional. Ooh. Have I got like a custom marker here? Well it's not possible, I've never been here before. <clears throat> I think it probably smells wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Oh you know what? The whole oh for god's sakes, yeah, the the, the whole Skyrim alright, hang on. Sound effects will be low because I have to turn it up on OBS specifically for Skyrim because it's maxed on Windows and maxed in the game. But um, Skyrim is just mixed slow, uh, low. So I've just done that now. <clears throat> so hopefully, once I get back into the game, it'll sort it. Alright, uh, you want to say something else? Look at the sky. What kind of place 
place is this? She's really quiet anyway. So, um, um, it's all wrong. Okay, right. Do you anything about this place? Just what my mother told me. I've also studied a little bit on my own, but there's not much. When something is trapped in a soul gem, and then the energy is used for powering an enchantment, the remnants are sent here. Yeah, I wasn't looking for a map. I was just trying to remove the um, marker. I will check the map, but right now, voices are good now. Okay, thank you, Becca. Any soul gem? Well, I think it's specifically the black ones. Oh, those. I don't know if the soul cairn takes just any leftovers. Hmm. Does anything live here? Look at this place. Do you think anything would want to live here? Well, the only things that can survive here are the ideal masters, the undead, and the souls themselves. Well, if you want to call that living. They exist. You think we'll meet the ideal masters? I don't think anyone's ever met the ideal masters. I'm not even sure anyone knows what they look like. They could be underground, flying above us. They might be the ground. I, I have no idea. <laughs> well, why are they collecting these souls? Lots of theories. Some say they feed on them like I feed on blood. Others think they use them as payment to an even higher power. Almost like a currency. A very strange currency. Whatever they're doing with them, they've been harvesting for millennia. No telling how many souls are trapped here. Many, many. I like the, I like the, um, the look of the place. Why would they command someone to deal with them? <clears throat> look around you. There are some extremely powerful undead here. Even a necromancer as seasoned as my mother would be willing to spend years trying to gain access to them. Some of them, you mean? Exactly. It's a lost art. Most necromancers just raise up whatever bodies are nearby. A simple trick, really. Child's play. Mm -hmm. But bringing something from the soul cairn gives you something much more powerful. So how do the necromancers communicate with them? Oh, that's usually the trick. It's possible to do it through a simple portal. But to finalize the deal, you have to travel here yourself. And most of them never come back. Hmm. Right. How is this a good idea then? There are many a little as the best chain. The food is both cheap and actually tasty, and they have the best salaries and benefits from employees. Cool. Oh, that's good. I have friends who work there after applying um, to most of them. But better doesn't usually actually mean good. <laughs> Uh, hi, Queen of the Silence. Welcome in. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. Thank you. Doing good? Uh, vanishing soon... Vanish soonly again. Work, 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 and it starts early. Sleep is important to me. Oh. More important than my dreams. That's... That's that's how it should be. That's it. <laughs> are you sure that, uh... Valeria? Valeria? Uh, it's Valeria and, and Erica, like, mixed together. Um, has the, has the Elder Scroll? I don't think anyone's ever met no, the God damn it. I'm no, not no, even no, sure no. anyone knows what they look like. Freaking interface. The vampire would be right at home. No. But there's no way she would have left it in Tamriel. She wanted Bored? to get this far well, away from my father. Hopefully I possible. cure that a little bit. I can't imagine a better place. And she doesn't? Then we find out where she hid it. If she's still alive. Well, as alive as she was before. Or as now. Or <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> Um, so why not hide it in the soul cairn and then return, yeah, to, to Tamriel? Probably to avoid whatever my father would do to her if he could get his hands on her. Or maybe her plan was to come back, but she was stuck here. Huh? We won't know until we find her. Alrighty. Let us continue. Bye. I mean, it did indicate we should go that way, so that's why I'm going this way. I'll find out what these are. Come right in, the water is lovely. <laughs> okay, so they do nothing. Ah. And this is a, yeah, invisible wall. Rahita, you got a back? Uh, I don't know what that means. Sorry, I can only assume no. How many scrolls do I have? Ooh! Okay, we're hungry. Yeah, yeah, we're hungry. That's fine. Um, The Nick horse in the area, I still don't know what you mean. 
I, I, uh, no, I don't. You can cast it, I don't know, I don't know, no. Mm. Okay, not an invisible wall, you know what I mean, like an impassable wall type thing. That's the last time I argue with a Dramora. Hmm, okay. Nothing like a bit of witty bants from the damned undead, right? <clears throat> Hello, Cell. I no longer hunger, grow weary, or feel anything but loneliness. Lonely. Oh, so lonely. <laughs> well, there's loot in there, I think. Is there? Might not be, actually. Hmm. That did something. Well. Oh, hang on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're lonely. Exactly, yeah. I I've met at least three people since I've been here. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. Oh, now it's gone. <laughs> uh, whoops. Uh, oh. Hmm. Well, that's a, uh, a name that I recognize. I was going to put that piece of soul gem into here. Like that. I'm sure that's not what I had to do. <laughs> Um, remember, in the end, 76 cliff racers were slaughtered. I was knee deep in the corpses and my body on the verge of collapse, but I had survived. I smiled to the heavens and all went black. When I awoke, all I felt was my back on a cold stone floor. Every muscle in my body was on fire and my vision was blurred. Slowly, I tried to climb to my feet. It took several agonizing... We're taking that. Yeah, that sounds about right, though. That sounds about right. That's that's very Morrowind. There's a potion there, you know. Maybe we can get it from around here. Hmm. No, it's not a coincidence. It's a definite, definite reference. I mean, I, t it, I worked so hard for it, I'm going to take it, even though it's useless to me. Hmm. <laughs> That's really cool. That looks awesome, actually. Glad I took the time to look back on that. Mm, mm. Super pretty. Yeah, it's very stylized. Very interesting. Um, I've harvested a soul. From this fissure. All right, then. As you do. If you were to murder someone in Skyrim, or, I don't know, say, example, Nazim, just off the top of my head, would he appear here if you soul trapped him? Um, I wouldn't ask me that. <laughs> But yes, it would be really cool if if you were using black like, soul gems and they appeared here. I don't think. Okay, I don't think um, the game would. I mean, that would take some scripting, right? To to create a flag to remember all that and then spawn them here. Where'd you come from? Came from the ground, bone man. Um. 
So let's just call it as it is. Skeletons, right? Skeletons. This is what it is. You can call it a board man if you want, but I know a skeleton when I see one. <clears throat> board man's lewd. <laughs> on max difficulty, these are very spongy. I think on max difficulty, everything is right. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not really sure if that's the best way to make a game harder. Just make all the fights longer. H six. Quickly stifled by the sound of over a hundred wakes. Rising from the fire as an entire colony of cliff racers, and they were out for blood. The blasted thing had led me right to their nest and sacrificed itself with the intent of feeding me to its brood. It was a trap. The damn things had become much too clever. Knowing this was likely the end, I jumped down from the silt strider and hit the back of its leg with the... I need to find all them. This is an engaging tale that we're uncovering. <clears throat> Did you know I visited elsewhere once? What a strange and wondrous place. Hmm. <laughs> More than more went than I did. Well. You must help me find my Arvac. Oh. He doesn't deserve to be in a place like this. Okay. Arvac, right. Um, yeah, exactly. Who's who's Arvac? This was mentioned in chat. Who's Arvac? Arvac, my horse. We came to this horrible place together. We were attacked by monsters, so I told him to run. Please, he's such a loyal creature, and he's been running for so long. You have to save him. A place like this will change you. Uh, um, how? Arvac, Arvac, where are you? Arvac, please come back. Come back. Come back, Arvac. Hmm. Farewell. Hmm. The sky. What kind of place is this? I should have looked at the sky, shouldn't I? Thank you for pointing that out because gamers never look up. I feel terrible for the dead who end up here for eternity. It seems awful. Like they're still suffering. The thing is, though, the thing is, it doesn't look like they're suffering. The only one who's suffering is him. One of them's a bit lonely. One of them's like, oh, I wish I had met with the Daedra. And the others just have forgettable things to say. It doesn't really. S it doesn't really bring to me souls in torment type thing and not really getting that vibe from them I'm back was roach you should get the rooftop skits yes indeed That's really cool. There's a sword in there. <laughs> sword of shocks. Certainly give this one a shock. <clears throat> no map, not easy to find it. Alright, so it's not on the map. Okay. I shall... Oh, well, we do have a local map, don't we? I'll have a look at it now, since it was mentioned. Um. Okay. So we started here, come down here. Now we seem to be circling around, back around again for whatever reason. Hmm. Well. I'm hearing a skelly bro. Sorry, a bone man. You up there? Can you get on the roof somehow?
Hmm. Curious. Thief 4? It... No, this is better than Thief 4 for its, for its map. He's definitely up there. Um, you like the soul can? Well, I don't. I don't dislike it. Is it? Is it uh, an area that's um, that's derived? You know, people people do not do not like it. You're annoyed with the concept of heaven being an eternity of brawling. Desolate boredom would probably be hell. I mean, yeah, sure, but put it in the writing. Tell us that these people are suffering. I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm not getting that at all from, from what they're, what they're saying. You know, there's no wailing, no gnashing of teeth. You've seen something, haven't you? Yeah, he's up there. That's annoying. Like, imagine this, this on, um, oops. Max difficulty, how many arrows it would take. Be here forever. Oh, you KSA. Mm. Because no map and the wrong spell, okay. Well, I think that the no map is a nice departure from. And I think that this the, the DLC's done it quite, you know, a couple of times. Like the, the back end of last session, it was. It was. Um, it had a couple of instances of not telling you what button to press, which I supported. Quite a large area then. I can't see how you can easily get turned around. Is that where we came in? It is. Okay. So that means I've been in here, right? I know I guess. Yeah, I got it. I agree. Yeah, we've been here. Ooh. Huh. That's cool, though. Can I get this? I'll take them, because I'm running out of arrows, I think. No, I, 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 I'm not... I'm not complaining. So that's, that's our, um... Uh, what do you call it? Oh, hello. Um, heh. Where'd you come from? I came from the ground. Oh. Hiya, skink. I saw a paper map somewhere with the different buildings marked uh, out of purpose, church, etc. Much better. So someone made a, a paper map, or like maybe it was with the collector's edition, whatever like that. Been here. <laughs> Probably something someone made. Fair enough. <clears throat> there was a profession in ancient times where people would measure distances by walking. Used a lot in expedi expedi expeditionary armies, they would usually get middle 1% error. I see. Well, I could I could try that, but All 
right? A larger structure here. Looks like this is some, some kind of road, maybe, no? <clears throat> oh, a skull you bring back. Oh, have I missed it? <laughs> like, if I've already seen it, let me know and I'll go back for it. I didn't realise I was looking for a skull. I thought I was looking for a... Um, silhouette of a horse, you know, like a horse soul. But I guess that doesn't work. That won't work, will it? No. Because only souls from black soul gems come here. But then how would the horse's skull get here? Can you get in here? me from the battle spire I will make them pay dearly there's no escape this is a little better what a horrible what kind of place. place is this okay please end this misery what a horrible place This place tears at me as though I am still alive and being there you go. drawn and quartered. I can't stand it anymore. Hmm. That's better. That's what I'm talking about. Leave me be. <laughs> that's 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 stuff I can get behind. Hmm. I would not even. How are you? getting my health drained but uh, all right I guess we change back now no wrong button <clears throat> I'm doing very good thank you yep I am doing fine thank you uh, what's this about clink so in their current fantasy war game setting, the Warhammer Fantasy Battles is often referred to as the world that was because it went down. Arcane won and all was destroyed. Yeah, sorry, I missed um Oh but Battle Spire? Hmm. Uh, uh yes, okay. <laughs> Didn't the Watts Ring bring down the moon or something? I I think I think that just Chaos won. And the Great Horned Rat was was um Confirmed to be one of the Lords of Chaos. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. One thousand steps and a thousand more. I could have got got over there. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was being really clever there. <laughs> I thought I was being dead clever going across here with bat form. Oh no, you can just go a freaking round. <laughs> oh well. Hey, Deviant. Welcome in. How are you? Good morning. Morning? Is it morning? Is it morning when you're in? It's morning. <clears throat> yeah, I was too clever for the game. Like... 
Because we didn't we didn't get anything for that, did we? So let's keep being watched. Being watched. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, so the whole the whole um plot is getting Oriel's bow. So we can Well not so shooting the sundown hasn't been mentioned yet, so careful with the spoilers. But um we know we want to find um, the or Oriel Bell. To deal with the sun, so. I need to sneeze. And I have. Woo. Okay. Objective complete. Feels good, man. Alright, I feel that everything is leading towards here. Oh, we got this as well, though. Man, okay. They really went out of the way to uh, get some new enemies, didn't they? Let's get exactly the same enemies, but call them something else and give them a slight retexture. Hmm. That's fine. What if you actually yeah, what if you what if you miss the sun? Grumpus isn't the best archer in the world, so that might happen. Right? That may well happen. Alright, let's just I think this is no. Okay, let's have a little look. Hi! My ship. What happened to my ship? Where am I? Page one. I am a hunter. I am a redeemer. I am Jwip. Jup. Tell my rise to glory begins in the ash waste of Morrowind. I rode alone, weapon at my side, and the burning wind stinging my face. Yeah, I know how that feels. My quest is odious, but necessary to ensure the, the survival of the dumber people. Pestilence was creeping across the ashlands, yes, the cliff races. I'm hoping to find all of them. All right, let's have a little look. Let's have a little look. Um, so, yeah, the problem is the problem is the functionality of of this because I can't really scroll far enough to orientate myself, and I can't add um, add notes to it. So that's um, like an issue. There's someone there. There's someone there. Oh, it's you. I got excited there. I thought, oh, I found something. No, no, I haven't. No, it's just, just you. Right, so... This bit's important. But let's just go over here first. That obviously goes to the next kind of area. It's segmented by this giant wall. That's where we came in. So yeah, I'm pretty confident we found everything. Um, this side, although I may be wrong. Just a hunch. Yes. Yes. Who's there? Who is there? I knew I had something. That'll teach you. A mod to rescue Jib? Oh, um, a Jib. What the hell? How the hell do you pronounce that? Um. So in my last Morrowind install, um, he got a house. We gave him a house and everything. By Aldrun. Go. Nope. 
I like this though, that's really cool. That reminds you of Thief 4. Well, yes, I mean, the interface is very like Thief 4 with it being all black and white. I just got some, some ice, you know. Don't mind me. Hey! Hey! Can you, um, deal with these at all? Thor Jim's like, I'm a firing my laser! I'm like, I don't, I don't want you to fire my laser, fire laser at me. Yeah, fire her. Oh, there's a wall there. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. We're going, we're going. Um... What's your level and skill? My, my my skill is terrible. No, sorry. Um, so we'll have a, we'll have a review of Grumpus, shall we? So, um, yeah, skills. So our character is an orc. His name is Grumpus Ghost by Space. He is level 19. And pretty much, <clears throat> when it comes to skills, this won't take very long. Uh, we've got um, two handed weapons. Bit of archery, bit of light armor, and lock picking. There you go. <laughs> that's that's our build. Now I'm um, usually quite um, keen on. Well, I suppose I suppose I am in this as well. You know, I'm quite keen on role playing, and um, and creating complex characters. Or, or at least quite nuanced characters with 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 quirks that um, that dictate what they can what they can and can't do. Um, and in this, we're just playing a. a the, I think the tagline for this whole series is, "We're playing a, a big dumb arc because Skyrim is a big dumb game." And it's working. It's working. It's working pretty well. There's kind of there's, kind of, there's a kind of a synergy going there. A soul gem. That's what it was. Oh. Ah. Then I must be. Oh no. Yep. Yep. This is no place for you. Did anyone else? Did anyone else see the horsey? I definitely saw it. I'm trying to pour another drink. Sorry. I'd heard stories about the Soul Cairn, but never. So I'm hoping. Myself. So far, it's. There we go. I imagined. Oh, nice. There we go. Perfect. Air, if we could splash the chest, we wouldn't. Even not. Yes, true. That's true. We wouldn't. Yeah. And it's still, thank you, Serena. It's it's still surprising that um, Bethesda still hasn't created a warrior version of lock picking, i.e., bashing locks. Oh, see. There's. Definite horsey. Definite horsey around here somewhere. Right, there's a cart here. This could be. Well, look what we have here. <laughs> Someone with flesh on their bones. Oh. Yeah, actually you do have you do have the option to force locks, but um it's part of the lock picking minigame, if you like. Um, and I think that's still dependent on your lockpicking skill, isn't it? Yeah, there's no bash in Daggerfall, exactly. <laughs> um, so you can fork the lock, but I, th I think it's more to do with lockpicking than it is with just bashing it. What are you doing? Um... <laughs> Sorry, Kat. What's the matter with you? Let's just say I sold something to a guy who turned out to work for a whole coven of necromancers. How in the name 
name of Zenitha was I to know the ingredients were phony? Do I look like someone in a double cross? I don't know about here. Um, we'll try it next time, because... Well, how can it depend on strength when there is no strength in the game, though? I'm talking about Skyrim specifically, right? Um, can you can you force locks in Skyrim? Yeah, I mean, in, in Fallout, you, it might be based on strength. I'm not sure. Um, but in Skyrim, removed open spells. Yeah, yeah, no, that's cool. No, it's easy. I mean, it, we can make it's the same company, so we can we can make that kind of. How do you got you? I have to keep talking. Horse, wagon, and all, plopped here without so much as a word. I used to be one of the best traders in Highland, mm. you know. I went one. How people would track me down just to see what I had for sale. Got anything left? Very funny. <laughs> I think Grumpus was was serious. Exactly are you going to pay me with? Take a look around. Gold doesn't exactly win you any friends around here. I can. It must be something you want. I'll tell you what. I appreciate what you're trying to do, so I'll play along. The only thing I see around here in abundance are soul husks. Uh, you know, those ugly fungus-looking things growing out of the ground. Bring me, say, my God. 25 of them, and you can rummage through what was left on my cart. Fair enough. Odds and ends I've gathered over the years. Well, used to gather before all of this. Fetch quest. That, this is a blatant busybody fetch quest, though, Tell this is. You're looking for, and maybe we can ah. make a deal if you have the husks. This is just a blatant, a blatant fetch quest. <laughs> you still got it, Morvin. A salesman even beyond the end. Why would you even want something that there's, a, there's an abundance of? It make any sense? Like if it's rare, you'd probably want to sell it to people or trade it. This is all wrong. Oh, it's wrong, is it? Okay. But there's there's loads of it around. So so why do you even care? Why do you want it? Oh my God, I have to go back and get all this stuff. Um, so about, uh, yeah, so, um, where are we on the Skyrim DLC? So we're in the, sh the Soul Cairn, we're looking for Serena's mother, who has one of the Elder Scroll. You'd be wrong. Let's just find my mother and get out of here, quickly. Um. To unlock the location of Oriel's bow. Well, that was, f that was... Terrible. <clears throat> so I don't know if I can bother going around getting all that stuff, but I've got to decide now if I'm going to. Um, um, so about because I quite enjoy these these conversations about and we're talking about bashing locks, right? And then White One says, you know, quite correctly that well, you know, the reason that warriors can bash locks is because it's the advantage that thieves have right you know if if warriors can bash rocks what's the point of being a thief and i, I think that's a really good point and i think that the trade-off for that is probably um you could do two things you could either damage the weapon right um if you have that kind of thing or you could damage the loot even destroy some of the loot by bashing the lock which I realize isn't strictly like an immersive type thing. It didn't make that much sense. But game wise, I think it would balance things out. But I, I still think that there should be. Um... Here we are. One. Well, I've got like. Alright, so that's four, because I already picked one up. <clears throat> The Monotone Purple, hello Shadowhawk, how's it going? Yeah, we're collecting um, coral, soul coral. <laughs> uh. Hi, Deadbeat, I uh, like the uh, bashing causing a chance to kill the loot. Yeah. Yeah, I think, oh, there's something going on there. Who's there? I knew I what are you doing? Who are you fighting? Oh, hello. 
Rathman! Rathman! Right, whatever's going on there is pretty important. But I almost want to leave it until I've got these 25 coral. <laughs> The CLC slaps, you like it, smart but uneducated? <laughs> I, um, first time playing here. First time ever playing it. This is on the original Skyrim. Not even the enhanced edition. No mods. This is as original as you can get. The enemy's right there, Serena. It's right there, yeah, thank you. Uh, but welcome, I hope you have a good, uh, a good time. And they're still trying to bouncing me around at full gallop. Finally, with the silent prayer, I realized I released the string. The arrow sang through the air like a howling demon, and it sliced its way towards its target. Finally, just as it crested the lip of a foyada, the arrow struck it in the midsection. It let out a horrible cry and fell out of sight. My cry of tri my cries of triumph were You have to piece all these together. No, oh, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. <clears throat> this is the best Dar uh, Skyrim DLC in your opinion so I've heard um, the same thing about Dragonborn which we'll be doing eventually oh uh, no that's not it you're actually talking like a proper dark elf what do you want uh what are you doing how does anyone expect me to write my opus with all of these rude interruptions? Opus? What do you mean? What do I mean, indeed? If I hadn't lost all of the pages, I wouldn't be in this predicament, and we wouldn't be yep. having this conversation. Still shirtless. <laughs> uh, let's just start at the beginning, shall we? Wake up, you're dreaming, yeah. moment or two of my time couldn't hurt. I am Chib. Yeah, but... Some call me Saint Chib. Right! Call First me time I've heard it said. <laughs> Perhaps you've heard of me. So, I have. I have. <laughs> but Grumpus obviously hasn't. I can't say that I'm surprised by your answer. Until I get my second volume published, no one will ever know of my achievements. Jib. Jib. Jib, Jib, Jib. His name is Jib. Okay. That's how you pronounce it. Jib. Awesome. Jib. You know how many times I've seen this word on the screen? But I've never, <laughs> never, ever, no, never been spoken to me. A book. I hardly call a 26 volume epic simply a book. Uh, Surely you've heard of the rise and fall of Saint Jim the Eradicator, hero of Morrowind and savior of the Dunmer. Uh, maybe. Uh, I think Grumbles would want a shorter title. <laughs> maybe you should leave the writing to an expert. Stop making foolish suggestions. Mm -hmm. All right. So how's he going? Terrible. Simply terrible. Right, this block. Or I was in the midst of writing the second volume, and they just threw me into this prison. It's unfair. Yeah. Uh, the prison, huh? You mean the soul can? So what? What in the name of a Vic are you talking about? All I remember is that damn Dramora and his minions bursting into my home and sending me to the prison. Adramora captured you. Well, I assume so. It cast a spell at me from some kind of strange black crystal. Yeah, black soul gem. Next thing I knew, I arrived here. So your soul was trapped. Even Grumpus knows that. What? Wait. That means... Break it to him gently and all. You're dead! <laughs> Grumpus doesn't do gently. No. All these wasted months, or has it been years? I don't even remember how much time has passed. Now my work will never see the light of day. 
My name will be forgotten. <laughs> Could I help? Perhaps. Do you have a way out of here? Actually, no. Um, yeah, I do, but you can't come. <laughs> That's not going to be a lot of a lot of solace to him, is it? Maybe I can't leave, but my writings can. In order to write the second volume of my opus, I need the notes from my first volume. Otherwise, I need to do all of this from memory. I will concur. I will. How many pages did you lose? When I was tossed, I felt myself falling. I dropped the pages I've been holding. Ten of them in all. Find them for me, please. I beg you. How did you earn your <laughs> nickname? Ah, yes. Four, okay, I got four. Hey, Jim, Jim the Eradicator. <laughs> I've earned a lot of those titles thanks to my campaign against the Winged Menace. Oh, really? The, uh, the Winged Menace? Yes, I'm speaking of the cliffs, of course. Wretched things. Really? Never heard of them. They used to crisscross the skies over Morrow with vermin. Nasty flying creatures with a habit of sneaking up on the unwary. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> and what was your campaign against them? After I was freed from prison, I decided to turn my life around. Give something back to the people of Morrowind. It became quickly apparent that the best way I could help would be by wiping out the cliff racers. Were you successful? Indeed I was. I hunted down and killed every last one of them. Took years. The people of Morrowind were so grateful to have the road safer again. They took to calling me St. Jim Ben. Then the other names followed. So why would a Dramara attack you? Well, that's a ridiculous question. Everyone traveling through here has said that the Oblivion gates have been opening all over Tamriel. Oh, have they? <clears throat> Well, apparently that was a bit before my time. Has it been that long? Oh my. It hasn't well, been that long though, has it? It started with the followers of Mehrun's Dagon. Why is it? The Emperor Uriel Septim VII assassinated. Without a Septim on the throne of the Empire. Okay, Dagon yeah, plenty, plenty of time. Through the gates and attack. Bless him. And why was Dagon able to do this? <clears throat> All I heard is that without a septum sitting on the throne of the Empire, the dragon fires in a place called the Temple of the One were no longer lit. This meant that we were vulnerable to the forces of Oblivion. Indeed, really. Eradication of the Confessors was a cross for jubilation. Love it. She's on her she is. Yes, she, she's got my back. I like it. I like it. I think I thought he just killed the ones in Vardenfell. He probably did, you know, when they were talk when he's when he's talking about Morrowind, I think he's trying to refer to the game. So that's that's I think that's that's why there's a difference. Um so what ended up happening? I don't know. Everything seemed fine until that Dramora attacked me. I only heard later about the gates from the other souls. Don't worry, Severi Axis saved it. I can only assume the gates have been closed. Oh, now. yes. Severax fixed it. Don't you worry. Uh, where were you captured? I had just moved from my ancestor home in Morrowind to the continent of Sea. in Morrowind, right. I settled in the city of Kavaj to write my memoirs and to find some peace and quiet. <laughs> Reduced to an ad. I kind of, I mean, I don't object to this, right? This isn't too egregious. Luckily, the example of 3.3 survived and stayed. Um, uh, is that why you were attacked? Indeed. One moment I was writing diligently, and the next, my door bursts open. Serena? It's fine. It was a cadre of Dramora. The city was under attack. 
took it upon myself to join the cause and fight the Dremora, thinking this would simply be another feather in my cap. <laughs> I guess it didn't work out. The reason I'm standing in front of you is only a whisper of my former self should tell you that. All right, well. I never knew what became of Gavage. I wonder if they were triumphant without me. Um. So I like this, right? This is this is really good. No, I I I I dig this. I dig this. So you said you were in prison. I had just moved from my ancestral home in Morrowind to the continent of Cyrodiil. I settled in the city of Kavaj to no, wait, wait, wait. memoirs Sakes. and to find some peace. No, no, wait, wait, no, 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 no. Sh shut up. Oh my God. Still over half the pages off. Yeah. No. That was a dark time in my life. I did a lot of things I ended up regretting. Maybe that's why I worked so hard to redeem myself once I was free. What did you do? I murdered others for money. And before you think I belong to some romantic or secretive guild, think again. I was simply an addict to needed money for Skuma. The stuff wasn't cheap, and murder always seemed to be in demand. How'd you get caught? I finally bit off more than I could chew. I was paid to assassinate some high-ranking official from House Redoran. What I didn't know is someone had hired the Morag Dong to kill him as well. A rival assassin. Exactly. He got to my target first and called the guard to cover his tracks. By the time I got there, the place was on alert. Jib Law, I know, it's cool. Walked right into a trap and didn't even realize it until I was captured. So what happened? They tried me for murder, threw me on a prison ship, and sent me to the jail in Vivek City. Gave me a lot of time to think, that's for sure. Yeah, I like how he doesn't mention, um, you know, the start of Morrowind. Like, specifically, it doesn't matter to him. <sighs> Just one, one extra little thing. No, you were sure they would let you go. I guess you were wrong, huh? Without my pages. Right, okay. Yeah, your freaking pages. So we've got two fetch quests now. Three if you count the horse. I've got a vax skull. That's great. Oh, missed man. Okay. They're exactly the same as the skeletons. But without legs. Okay. Hey! Okay. So we found the horse. Now we definitely have two, um, two fetch quests. I wonder why they were coveting the um, horse's skull. Harvac, oh, you're there. wretched place but i'm sure he'd be much happier someplace sunnier so now we have a horse because just to... Goodbye, that's hero. cool take good care of arvac for me such a good horse 
Nice. So now we get a no no we have to do this. Okay. Uh bye. You gonna let me go? Thanks. Okay. Um hmm. Magic hours? Shouts? At all. Summons are back to the Soul Cairn or Tamriel Wilderness. Yeah. It costs 120 star uh, magicka. I don't even know if I can even cast this. Alright, I can. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I only have. I've never leveled up my magicka. I've only got a hundred of it. No RC. I mean, yeah, a hundred. Hundred. It's quite a bit. That's six levels I've got to do for that, and it's worth it. I could fortify magicka, I think, but just to cast the spell. I mean, I can maybe do it once to see what it's like. Guys, what's going on? Not, not a lot, huh? Oh, uh, what the? The miss men attack. Miss. No, I don't think you are. What have you seen? Something over here? No? Yeah, not a very good one. Ah. No, no, yeah, it's still you. seeing any part of a, of a journal though that's cool though I know I know jump 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 whoa You died in Project Zomboy? That sucks. Stupid car failed and I got eaten. Oh, Well, spawn a new character and go and get your stuff back, dude. Go and, go and, go and, go and grab it. Okay, that's interesting. Should we... Okay. Oh, come on! It's the worst bottle ever. Yeah, Project Zomboid's, uh, Project Zomboid's tough. It's it's really tough. It's one of those games that... I, I wanted to get into. Um, and I, I still do. Um, but it's got quite a, quite a learning curve. I tried playing it with a few friends, and we all spawned in different areas. And I think it's because I set the game up wrong, but it was, like, it, it was pretty tough to get together. And even when we did... So these are portals, right? I wish I'd known that. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, we're here. We're on this. Okay. Ah. <clears throat> 
Okay. Well, we've played Dark Souls. We know how this goes. Charge! Great enemy design. I think we've got something new now. That's cool. Correct! <laughs> now we can't loot him now, unless this is it. Mm, yeah. Go with the grand soul. I'll take it just for the fact that it's pretty, I guess. Wow. So he's down there somewhere? Maybe maybe he just disappeared. But well done. Well done, Serena. Keep us a big boy. Yeah, yeah, so it seems like it. Oh. So we can't get further up. Yep. Hurry this, you build the casual, yes. Um So that was neat, but what what did it do? Uh, so um I I married um a woman who worked at a zoo yeah uh, when I when I visited I looked at her and I thought she's a keeper yeah 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 <clears throat> yeah all right that's it then we can't get any further up this kind of has um Zelda Ocarina of Time vibes to it a little bit at the end I don't know how many of you are gonna uh, know what I mean. But... <laughs> Thanks, guys. So this area is kind of cool, but I also kind of think it's it's a little bit of a um, an area to make the playtime longer because of this. Flat out of my glass blade, there was no need for the innocent thing to die here today because of my stupidity. Um, oh right, so he sent the um, <coughs> the silver right away as the ash cloud. Cleared from being stirred up by its massive legs, the cliff racer brood approached. I held my sword high and prepared for the worst. The battle lasted two full days. I was beaten, clawed, bitten, and knocked down more times than I care to. Well, that's half of it done. Uh, you gotta. <laughs> <laughs> Bit like the fade, yeah, yeah, I can see it being equated to that. All right, come back, come back. Oh, you're fine. You're a strong, independent woman. You don't need you don't need Grumpus's help. That was just where, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, he was. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe they're running out of time or something. Yeah. This is the horse's skull, okay. 
So I skipped this area here thinking it was something important, but now I'm dubious of whether it is. Hi, Bobby Um, What's the big hammer? Where's... Oh, you're right, actually. Well, I'm pressing one, and, and the axe isn't there. And I can't be bothered um, going into the inventory to finding it, because it, this is this is working out just fine. But you're right. Um, oh, nice. Yeah, we need these. Step into the painting, he said. Sure. Like it's that simple. Oh, that's a reference. That's a reference. That's definitely a reference. <clears throat> Big hammer streams. Even if I find all these, I won't be able to remember where I uh, got that quest from now. It was near the main gate between these two areas. <laughs> like I do, alright, we do, we do have, don't we? I can axe even, sorry. But did I sell it? I must have sold it, you know. Yeah, we've only got, um, like hammer and hammer. I should be using this one as well, really. So yeah, no axe currently. Sorry about that. <clears throat> Hammer's better than axe? You reckon hammer's better than axe? Well, you're wrong. But we're deviating a little bit from our baseline. Actually. Yes, you see, the, the, you, you know, ask you a question, right? You can't make many, um, um, puns with hammers. Like a reference to a song. That's about it, right? But uh, let me know if I'm wrong. <laughs> oh, oh, hello, Rube. How are you? Oh, hello. Uh, last shift was painfully slow and still two hours to go. Uh, yeah, we've all been there. <clears throat> Probably not too bad and that you're uh, doing good. Of all the elves, the hammer are the worst. Ah, yeah, see. Um, when you have a hammer, every mob is a nail. That's clever. It's not a pun, though, is it? Grumpus, much like another famed adventurer, I don't think particularly likes portals. <clears throat> but, yeah, that goes into that building, so... Still? The hide? Okay, alright. I mean, I'm actually tempted to wear this now. Seen any elves? <laughs> Hi, you, Chris. <clears throat> um, because that increases our magic by 30 points, puts it up to 130. And we need 160 to cast that um, summon horse steed ghost spell. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh! All of them. Is that all we need? Okay, items. Um, so it'll be... Is it an ingredient? Just a miscellaneous. Man, so many stuff and things. What the hell's a soul husk? Is it food? It is, apparently. Okay. Interrupts soul drain effects in the soul can. Anyway, we've got we got twenty five of them, so that's good. So we can go back to that dude with the with the thingy now, with the thingy and the stuff and the stuff and the thingy. You know, the merchant. No such thing as too much ambition, Sammy. Only lack of motivation. Very poignant. Potion of healing. Ah! You see? You see? Alright. I noticed there was an awful lot in this miscellaneous thing. Have we got any, like, dragons? Oh my god. And I've also grabbed the chat. No! Ugh. Alright, I forgot this now. I'm scrolling the chat window. When I use the mouse wheel. It's, it's, it's dead annoying. Yep, still doing it. Can I use, okay. Okay. Um... Yep. Yep, we're carrying... There you go, that's it. Get, get lost. Okay. Oh, hi! <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have done... Okay, yes, I see you. I see you. <clears throat> yeah, that should really help. Um, yes, okay. That will massively help. I did wonder, because we're not carrying that much. I've got to... Okay. <laughs> okay, so I'll give you that one. I'll give you that one. Krupus was told he could explore Skyrim and go ham, so he, he did, and he's still hammering. I've got the old hammer out as well. Um... So we should have a Dawn Guard hammer, yes, put that on one. Two hundred years after Oblivion, huh? All right, so now let's try and orientate ourselves and get back to that dude with the carriage. Lucky. <laughs> um, hmm. I can appreciate people who use hammers, if anything, they're very blunt. <laughs> Alright, alright, it's good, it's good, I like it. This is bringing the best out of you, chat. Get out while you can. The fourth era started when Akatosh killed the Avatar of Miran's Dagon. And that was the same year, or the next year, after the Oblivion Gate opened, depending on how, pe how people played. Axes are also blunt, it's true. 
One thousand steps, and a thousand more. Grinder was tiring, but I couldn't give up. I had to swan to eliminate the foul beast to the last, and I wasn't about to let go. If I was going to stop the thing, I'd have to do it fast. Pulled my longbow from my back and knocked my last arrow, took a deep breath and pulled, trying to keep the cliff racer in my sights. It was literally a long shot with the base beast gaining distance. Where'd you come from? Oh. Ah! Grumpus enjoys himself. He enjoys whacking things with hammers. He likes it. Right, don't know where I am. <clears throat> Do you try to climb to the throat of the world? Uh, so yeah, I need you guys to to, 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 to tell me these references because they can be lost on me. Ah! Hard day for you, mate. Hmm, something we've been here. They all look the same, so I am Mega. Grumpus would like be a blacksmith assistant just hammering all day I think he would I don't think he'd want to be an assistant that ice spike in his head yeah bad day for him oh I, no that's not it uh, yeah we'll take that Leave me alone. There's no Jewib stuff here. I'm <laughs> still gonna call it Jewib. <laughs> still gonna do it. Unfortunately. <clears throat> One thing I'm curious, and I don't mind spoilers on because I'm unlikely to play this again, is if you come here, if you sign with the Dawn Guard. This is a big area to only use with one side of the coin, if you see what I mean. But I don't see how you would come here as a member of the Dawn Guard. Unless you're supposed to stop the vampires from getting doing the same thing, right? You learn that they're after Oriel's bowl, and you've got to go into the soul can, but Hmm. Hello, Sorcerer Dave. It's been a long time. Been a long time. How have you been? <clears throat> I am a bit lost wandering around this vast wilderness. It all looks the same. Right, I'm back here again. You still get Serena and you have basically the same quest. You basically choose the more sensical part of the quest line. Yeah, because why would you be helping? <laughs> we hear the vampires are trying to block out the sun, so uh, 
just continue to help them and see what 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 i guess it's been a while normally catch your streams on youtube at the moment yeah right, that's 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 good that's what they're there for um hope you've been enjoying them how have you been you've been all right looks like morrowind oh shot fired shots fired shots fired shots fired i'm triggered i am triggered Why do you do things to annoy me, right? You upset me. I've been here as well. Okay. Well, maybe we can back on the map, though. What am I doing? If we have to return this... It's not... It's not, um... Might on the map. <clears throat> okay, fair enough. Because part of the DLC is the storyline between both factions is almost identical. You need to get them both first, said the leader of the Dawn Guard. No, kill the vampires. Then you kind of solve the problem, right? <clears throat> you can use a pl choose to play as the closest thing that Skyrim has to an elven mage faction. Or is a painfully generic do good of faction? Alright, so the Dongard growl at Serena, her being a vampire and all, but they still let you both go here to get the bow. You can't enter here if you're not a vampire, but Serena soul traps your soul. A bit. It's okay. Yeah, I. I, I I, yeah. Yeah, I probably have issues with all that. Yeah. Because currently, like, you know, the only objection I've, I've really had to the quest is the order of how things are being done. Why Luther um, has so much time for you. It's kind of the only thing that I've had a gripe about. Like, everything otherwise kind of makes sense, if you like. That's over half of the pages found. Keep it up. Yeah, it apparently, Dave, it, it does make a bit more sense. Although it falls off. <laughs> That's just amazing. I absolutely love that. Feel my wrath, wrath man. <laughs> oh, I'm so funny. Oi! Oh, yeah. Nice. It's been two years. Why is he trying looking for the pages? Time has no meaning when you're dead. I don't know what the point of doing that is, though. Is it to get a black soul gem? I mean, I have no need for those. Like, Grumpus just thinks through a black stone. <laughs> Doesn't even really pick them up. <laughs> thinks it's a lump of coal or something. No. Is that what the for then? Right? Is that what it does? Grumpus doesn't do soul collecting or much collecting at all, really. Like if it was shiny, maybe, but um, it didn't. So it's coal that doesn't burn. So not not a lot of use for it, really. I have a marker on my map. Well, that's what's that leading to? <clears throat> Probably that one, right? Yeah, I don't want to do that. Yet. I mean, I will. I've trudged around this area for over an hour now. So, uh, thanks for sticking with me, guys. I guess you expected it, though. One moment, I'm raising a sword against... 
experienced that necromancer, the next moment I found myself here. What happened? <clears throat> this was my experience. I simply got bored and quit it. Well, I can't. I have an obligation to my adoring public to to keep going. I've been here as well. Where'd you come from? <laughs> Just, like smashing everything. <laughs> 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 My character just has one move. <laughs> but it works. <laughs> big dumb orc in a big dumb part of a big dumb game. Seems so. This is what I saw earlier. Okay, this is what I skipped thinking it was important. Is that a keeper? Miss. Just go toe to toe with this dude. Oh, then. Ah! A worthy adversary! Ha 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 ha! Ah, does she work in as a. And now I will sit. No, I won't sit here. Now all the souls have gone. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I thought that was important. I don't know why. Well, I mean, apparently, you know, when you kill a keeper, some souls get released or something. So maybe it, it is important. Maybe we got to kill all the keepers or something. I don't know. So I'm hoping we'll find the guy with the cart around here pretty soon, so I can do some bartering of some kind. I'm hungry. There's nothing to eat around here. Hello, FK. How's it going? How was your Monday? How was everybody's Monday? May as well make that a far-reaching question. I don't think I've been out here. Well, you know. It was a Monday. Nobody asked how Monday was. Oh, it stayed there. Amazing. Yeah, that makes a black one, right? Okay. I mean... Oh, missed. I apologize. Occasionally, I also remember... I've got um, Bus Rodar to play with, and I've also got Berserker Rage. That's that's our, that's our skill repertoire right there. <laughs> got three things, and I forget about two of them most of the time. Um, been okay, okay. I mean, that's what you can expect, right? Working from home and have D and D late is so pretty good. Ah, so are you a player or the dungeon master? And what addition? Uh, we are working on the plumbing, so there's a lot of construction noise right above our heads. Ugh, that's annoying. Super tired. Was it productive? Good at work. And I got more systems working on my server, including a web video player for my VODs. Well done, Becca. That's, that's some good stuff. That's more than I ever... That's more than I'm doing. Yeah. Um, started my second semester yesterday. Today was alright. First lectures are pretty chill. Yeah, good. What are you studying? I remember when I tried decorating my house in Skyrim. First came out and took hours plus everything I wanted. I know where this is going. 
uh, without them jumping around. I, I was overjoyed, saved the game, close it, next day I reloaded my save, everything flew around like fireworks, and I was done. <clears throat> yes. Yes. I thought that was where that was going, and suddenly I was right. Um, five edition, playing a ranger, classic cowboy uh, bounty hunter. Oh my god, we're back at gym. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Everywhere I go, all, ro all, all roads lead to gym. Gym. Well, I've forgotten how to pronounce his name. Um, alright. I'm gonna go south. That's the direction I'm gonna go. Yeah, we could also put on this, um... That. That. Wouldn't we? We don't normally wear helmets, but... Or do any harm, I don't think. <clears throat> um, pretty much the invitation to only scaring players to make the mistake of treating it as a role blank. <laughs> Keep going south, keep going south. But sorry to tell you, you, if you can predict the outcome, it's, uh, it's boring to read it. I've lost you, sorry. Okay. See, that's like something that you would hear someone say in a market square. You click on them and say, oh, you know, I went to elsewhere once. And I've been here before. Where the hell do I go? I am lost. Maybe I'll just skip all this rubbish and just do the main quest. It's getting tedious. Yeah, this is about where we were before. Keep going. Yeah, well, it's really boring, though, white one. It's so boring. I don't know where I've been, which I know is kind of my fault, I guess, for not being um, systematic. No, I just lost. <clears throat> the wagon though yeah okay no this is fine this is good you might let us in there brought some soul husks sure got plenty what am i gonna do with it what my armor well i hate to see it go but that what sucks am I going to do with it here anyway okay brilliant <clears throat> thanks i got for light armor i get a shield what no, I want light armor, like actual armor. Right, well that was a complete waste of time. Um, okay, so... Light armor, am I right? Six. Really? Okay. <clears throat> so 
this is where we first came in, right? I don't know if I thought this dude. I might have So this is what it's like on the other side. See, it's just like mild curiosity. It's not. It's not really giving me a, a sense of. Um, you know, everything's terrible. I went to Elfbear once. Great, good for you. Good for you. <laughs> You're following this road, shall we? Who's there? I'm the worst superhero. <laughs> Alright, then this is important. This is probably part of the main quest. Which I will look into. I am so ready. I'm so done. I'm like, I mean, it's been like an hour and a half, pretty much. Yeah, an hour and a half of, of this. And I'm like, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm fine with, with not doing dupes thing. Honestly, I'm really fine with it. But, it's not it's a dead end. So, this does look important. Yes, it does look like you can get there. But not quite yet. For some reason, which is fine. <clears throat> An hour and a half, well, I mean, it's, 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 it's fine. <laughs> Alright, there's still plenty over here, so... Nice, nice lighting, though, right? Nice, nice shadows. Yeah, but pretty early on, I kind of maybe identified that this was here to extend the uh, the playtime of the DLC, so they could say it was like 12 hours or whatever, when you spend three hours here looking for pieces of paper. Just step into the painting, he said. Yeah, sure. I guess that's it. <clears throat> Let's try over down here, then. Yeah, definitely, definitely seems like padding. All of this seems like padding. There's a, there's a pyramid over there. That's unusual. <clears throat> and yeah, this is where we found the horse. I've been here. Okay. All right. Um, this way. <clears throat> well, it's not, it's not the distance that it takes to travel between places. It doesn't take long to get from this ruin to that ruin. That's not the issue. I know it's not really what you're saying either, but... So it is pointing to here. Yeah, absolutely is. Okay. Right there. Hmm. We can't. Mother. Oh. Can't be. Serana? Is it really you? I can't believe it. How do we get inside? We have to talk. Serana, what are you doing here? Where's your father? He doesn't know we're here. I don't have time to explain. I must have failed. Harkon's found a way to decipher the prophecy, hasn't he? 
You know, you've got it all wrong. We're here to complete the prophecy our way, not his. Wait a moment. You brought a stranger here? Yes. You lost your mind? I'm a stranger. You, come forward. I would speak with you. No, I don't so speak to. Okay. So how is it going to pass <laughs> that a vampire of mixed blood is in the company of my daughter? Well, uh... <clears throat> um... Uh, um, hmm, hmm. I've been keeping her safe. <laughs> uh, hi, hi, genetic. Um, would explode if you tried to cast magic. Yeah, it is a missed opportunity. It should be a power, shouldn't it? That's the first place I went. I thought it would be a power, but it's a spell. Like, why is it a spell? It should be a power. But powers are only once a day, aren't they? So, that's why. Um,. That's why it's not our power. Anyway, um, um. Uh, yes, uh, I, I saved it from, uh, I'm just here for the Elder Scroll, I guess. I mean, uh, the Elder Scroll. Glorious. Serana claims you're her guardian. She never said that. First she never said that! Lead. I see that my daughter is still as naive as ever. Serana has sacrificed everything to prevent Harkon from completing the prophecy. I would have expected her to explain that to you. You never said I was... <laughs> There's so little dialogue in this game, and, and they still get it wrong. Um, uh, well, that's why I'm here for the Elder Scroll. You think I'd have the audacity to place my own daughter in that tomb for the protection of her Elder Scroll alone? The scrolls are merely a means to an end. The key to the tyranny of the sun is Serana herself. Huh? What do you mean? When I fled Castle Volkahar, I fled with two Elder Scrolls. The scroll I presume you found with Serana speaks of Ariel and his arcane weapon, Ariel's bow. The second scroll declares that the blood of Cold Harbor's daughter will blind the eye of the dragon. Ooh. Like myself, Serana was a human once. We were devout followers of Lord Molig Ball. Tradition dictates the females be offered to Molig Ball on his summoning day. Few survive the ordeal. Those that do emerge as a pure blooded vampire. We call such confluences the Daughters of Cold Harbor. Mm. Cold Harbor? Mm. It's what some call the domain of Molag Ball. His place in oblivion. Did she undergo this? Well, I could ask her this, but hey. It was expected of her. Just as it was expected of me. Being selected as an offering to Molag Ball is an honor. She wouldn't have dared turn her back on that. It requires her blood. Now you're beginning to see why I wanted to protect Serana. Right. And why I've kept the other Elder Scroll as far from her as possible. So he means to kill her? If Harkon obtained Ariel's bow, and Serana's blood was used to taint the weapon, the tyranny of the sun would be complete. Ooh. In his eyes, she'd be dying for the good of all vampires. <laughs> Two fight justification. Uh, <clears throat> I will never allow that to happen. Apparently, apparently, I will not allow that to happen. Right? Yeah. App apparently. And how exactly do you plan on completing the prophecy without the death of my daughter? Um. Hmm, hmm. I know she's right there. You'd think that. I mean, if this is news to her, she would need to probably react to it. But it probably isn't. So why is she so keen to get the 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 the, the bow and like? Oh, need your help. Have you been listening to me? Like Serana, I'm a pure-blooded vampire. 
My presence on Tamriel is as much of a danger as hers. And uh, yeah, what's your opinion, Serana? Let's see if she answers this. You care nothing for Serana. She's or right there. She's, she's there. You see the tyranny of the sun as your chance at deification. And like Harkon, you won't hesitate to destroy anything that stands in your path. She's... But she believes in me. <laughs> Why won't you? <clears throat> Serana? Oh! The stranger may call himself a vampire, but he knows nothing of our struggle. Why should I entrust you to him? This stranger has done more for me in the brief time I've known him than you've done in centuries. How dare you? I gave up everything I cared about to protect you from that fanatic you call a father. Yes, he's a fanatic. He's changed. But he's still my father. Why can't you understand how that makes me feel? If you'd only open your eyes. The moment your father discovers your role in the prophecy, that he needs your blood, you'll be in terrible danger. So to protect me, you decided to shut me away from everything I cared about. You never asked me if hiding me in that tomb was the best course of action. You just expected me to follow you blindly. Both of you were obsessed with your own paths. Your motivations might have been different, but in the end, I'm still just a pawn to you too. I want us to be a family again. But I don't know if we can ever have that. Maybe we don't deserve that kind of happiness. Yeah, I would not even. Maybe I know. Maybe it isn't for us. But we have to stop him. <laughs> before he goes too far. And to do that, we need the Elder Scroll. I'm sorry, Serana. I didn't know. I didn't see. I've allowed my hatred of your father to estrange us for too long. Forgive me. If you want the Elder Scroll, it's yours. Your intentions are still somewhat unclear to me. But for Serana's sake, I'll assist you in any way that I can. So, uh, 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 do you happen? To, uh, do you happen to have it with you? <clears throat> yes. Oh. I've kept it safely secured here ever since I was in prison. That's convenient. Fortunately, you're in a position to breach the barrier that surrounds these ruins. Also, da. <laughs> what do we need to do? You need to locate the tallest of the rocky spires that surround these ruins. Oh. At their bases, the barrier's energy is being drawn from unfortunate souls that have been exiled. Destroy the keepers that are tending them, and it should bring the barrier down. Right. We'll return soon. We've already done two of them. Word of warning. There's a dragon that calls itself Dernevir roaming the cairn. Be wary of him. Yeah, but I've got... The ideal masters have charged him with overseeing the keepers, and will undoubtedly intervene if you're perceived as a threat. You think they've done that anyway? I killed two of them. Yeah, I already killed two-thirds of them. You think the Guardian Dragon would be paying attention? Uh, that's enough of that for now. Be careful, and keep my daughter safe. Let's kill oh. those keeper things and get back to the prison. Well, you already have. You sent one flying off a building, you remember? It was badass. So we'll kill these three, and then the dragon will spawn. We have, we do have dragon rend. That's the thing that we have. That's a shout that we've got. That's kind of cool, I think. We'll use that. I think it forces them to land or something. Can't remember. Ooh. Grumpus, Grumpus, calm down. Grumpus, it's there. Hmm. Okay. Oh, all right then. Yes, 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 yes. You're gonna drain my soul, etc., etc. So why does her mother look younger than Serena? I mean, that's possible, though, isn't it? If they undergo, uh, un did the the change of vampirism at, vampirism at different times. But I don't think they did. So yeah, it makes no sense. <clears throat> why is there a chicken in here? Oh, don't we do right, right? Do not question.
Chickens also go to hell. Yeah, apparently. Apparently chickens also, also go to hell. <clears throat> yeah. I live in a dark world where no light comes through. I carry this burden with every step I take. Right, here we go. <laughs> I'm so good at this game. Wow, okay, that worked. Yeah, distract them. You did great. You did great. You, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. I can't see any more thingies to open this. Excuse me! Can you just pass me what's in that loot crate, please? I mean, there's nothing there anyway. Loot crate. Chest. Um, they've all been rubbish so far, the ones behind those kind of things. Oh, hello. No, that was kind of cool. That was kind of cool. I like that. Oh, I've got a crossbow. I forgot about that. Did I miss that? I missed it. <laughs> Wait a minute, maybe crossbows don't work. Let's kill those keeper things and get back to the prison. Um Oh okay. Stop it! Yes! Yes, yes, yes. That's awesome. Let's put them on. Just a casual 20% extra damage. Instead of unarmed, which I was doing for a bit of a laugh. <clears throat> Nope, that's good. That's good. That's that's really that's a, that's a very very nice um, upgrade. Yeah, that's true. That's true. I was complaining about the loot. How dare they cast me from the battle spire? I will make them pay. But I don't mind that, right? I'd rather I'd rather have the game, you know. Um, what's it called? Reverse psychology, right? Right. And it worked. It worked. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's so good. We're a good team. We're a good team, Serena. We're a good team. I respect your abilities as a mage. Or a vampire, I guess. Well, you know what I mean. <laughs> yes, I know what you mean. Hello. 
sort of bot, huh? <laughs> it does nothing against the hammer of Grumpus, though. Might have to have a heal, though. Yeah, we do. <laughs> Um, 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 potions. There we go. Eat three cheese wheels? That's not a bad idea, actually. I don't have much food, you know. Like, I really don't have much at all. There's going to be a big bad thing up here, you know. Big shield. Not big enough. We'll check its um, drops later. Or I may well just forget. ghostly remains, wasn't it? Okay, so... Excuse you while you pause time and space to munch on some foods and drinks. Is that's what happens? I mean, to be fair, that's what happens in a lot of RPGs. That's a nice effect. Apparently, I've been glad <laughs> how it falls out again. Oh, that's so funny. So, so chunky. Well, that was easy. They're not so big on the, um... Hello down there! Um, I forgot what I was going to say now. <clears throat> the pages anymore? Yeah, I shouldn't have taken the the the, um, the void salts because they were not. Um, shiny. <clears throat> right, so there's another thing to shoot somewhere. Oh, there. Not, not too obscure, is it? Check around here. That's what it came in, I think. Thank you, Vado. Thank you. I think I'm bringing out arrows, you know. How many arrows have I got? I've got 12 Dwarven. 36 Orcish. Okay. We got a bolt as well. I'll take that for the um lightning rods. Yeah. This would be great if you if you if you actually wanted or needed. Like soul gems, but um not not heavy on my uh, 
A Reaper gem. Yeah, I'm thinking I may, might have been collecting those. I don't know what they were. Yeah, the Reaper gem seems important, right? Well, I don't know. But... difference in damage between the bow and the hammer now. Something's still trying to kill us. Is there a dragon? I feel there's going to be a dragon fight soon, you know. I'll have to look what dragon renders. Oh, can I get in here? You good? Oh, no. <laughs> I don't know how it works genetic, genetic really I'm not I'm not quite sure honestly <clears throat> it renders the dragon you can't see it otherwise thumbs up for that one Hello, Lodash! It is fantabulous to see you. How are things? Take it, but do. Excellent. Because currently we just have vampire boots on because they look cool. Hmm. Some pretty good bonuses here. It's a shame that it doesn't work like in Morrowind in that, that extra carrying capacity, that extra... Lower percentage would actually make us faster. Yeah. No, this place has been alright for loot. New gloves, new boots. Yes. Well, oh, minutes, but I finally managed to do it. As my eyes adjusted to the dim light of my new surroundings, I realized I was standing before Lord Vivek himself. He was simply staring at me, floating above his throne and staring at me with his piercing eyes. When I began to prostrate myself in a sign of respect, he held up one of his hands as if to say it wasn't necessary. Was I dead? Was Lord Vivek pleased with me? Was he... 
Seven out of ten. <clears throat> like the cut of his jib. <laughs> yes, indeed. Uh, we're not going to find the other, the three though. You always kill the Vec? Who would do such a thing? Only three more? Yeah, but no. <laughs> if you had smaller handwriting, it would be less pages, exactly. It's his own fault. Like, if they were tracked, I would. And I know, like, I, I am a detractor <laughs> of the tracking system, right? But in an area like this, which is massive, and it all looks the same, and it's very hard to keep track of where you are. I'm not willing to spend what could be anywhere up to an hour looking around for, for that. I'm not going to do it. It's not going to. It's not going to happen. What does Dragon Ren do? Yeah, forces it to land. Probably going to be useful. I can summon a dragon. Wow, okay. Didn't realize that. Reward, though? It'll be really boring, Boto. <clears throat> If I knew what the reward was, that would give me incentive. Not saying saying there is a reward doesn't really cut it. Um, but I kind of get that you you know you kind of want to don't want to give me spoilers and stuff. I respect that and appreciate that. But in this case, spoilers are absolutely fine. If you tell me what I'd get for finding those three pages, then it would give me the incentive to actually do it. But if it's uh, oh, you get uh, you know ten light armor, then. Uh, nah. Yes. <laughs> Would not even. You're right. Anyway, I probably wouldn't do it. I'm not going to do it. I can't be bothered. I really cannot be bothered. You managed to destroy all three keepers. Yes. Very impressive. Unless they happen to be here, but they're not. That would have been... If there was two there, then I'd be like, man, there's only, like, one left. One you had her. Hmm. Okay. There was a necklace with an in a 5, plus 50 stamina and 50 carry weight. Hmm. What am I currently I currently have in health thirty. Hmm. Well, so it's nah. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. Because <clears throat> carry weight's fine, because I, I travel pretty light anyway. The stamina is nice, but that's all it is. You know, I might get one more critical attack. I'm not going to do it. Sorry. You managed to destroy all three keepers. They gave us a scroll. Yes. Please follow me. Keep watch for Dernavir. With the prison's barrier down, he's almost certain and the to law. investigate. I'll look it up, okay? I will. I will Google it. I am not going to do it. You guys don't want to see me run around this area for three more bits of paper.
moaning the whole time that I'm doing that very thing. Where's Selena? Well, I don't want to do it, okay? <laughs> you know, there, there is this... Well, this is definitely the dragon fight. There is the small factor that I don't want to do it. Let's not forget that. Oh my god, really? What a surprise. What an amazing surprise. I did not expect that in the slightest. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, they're gonna... Now nah, you're gonna summon stuff. Right, okay. Hi! <laughs> Summertime! No, 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 mate, no, mate. It's, that's not landing. That's, that doesn't count. Right, I might as well do this stupid thing then. She's around. Oh, she's done again. Where the hell is Serena? He dodged it? Oh, I thought I just cast it and that would make him land. Well, that sucks. Yeah, it sucks. I'm not gonna do it. Someone. <laughs> uh, hmm, 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 hmm. It's the force, though, isn't it? Like the literal force of the shout, like the air. Yeah. Hey! Um, alright, might be useful then. It's on cooldown though, so... Good hit. We got him. We got him. We could pause time and heal. <laughs> so... <laughs> looks to be you. Eat it. Loads? Hang on a minute. That was it? Okay. Uh, oh, no. Oh. I was hoping for a bit of loot from the dragon, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I mean, I didn't expect the loot. I wasn't... I forget how, how, how Dragon Souls were even um, used in the game. <clears throat> well, fine then.
<clears throat> Give my astonishment, <clears throat> but I never thought I'd witness the death of that dragon. Nah, she looks pretty old. No offense. I can say no offense, and, and she can't take offense. That's how that's how it works. Ooh, lasting potency, eh? No, I don't, but there might have been some extra stuff in there, you know. I mean, not that not that, that, that Grumpus needs lasting potency, you understand. What the hell does that do, anyway? But, um... You know... Uh, magic regeneration. 100% passive for 300 seconds. So, yeah, completely useless for him. But, yeah, lasting potency, eh? Okay. If you say so. Should I be uh, noticing something here? Forgive my astonishment, but I never thought oh. I'd witness the death of that dragon. Uh, what makes you say that? Volumes written on Dernivir alleged that he can't be slain by normal means. It appears they were mistaken. Uh, Unless... Grumpus is not normal. He's not normal. The soul of a dragon is as resilient as its owner's scaly hide. It's possible that your killing blow has nearly displaced Dernivir's physical form while he reconstitutes himself. How long will that take? We're talking about 30 seconds? Minutes? Hours? Years? I can't even begin to guess. I suggest we don't wait around to find out. Now, mm -hmm. let's get you the Elder Scroll and you can be on it. Yep, if, it, if you stat it, we can kill it. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. Thanks. Now that you've retrieved the Elder Scroll, you should be on your way. Right. Now that you've retrieved the Elder Scroll... Yeah, but it's, it's, it's pointing to you, so I have to keep following you, apparently. I don't, I... Yeah, I probably came with the box. Yeah. I came in the box. Have I talked to you? Now that you've retrieved the Elder Scroll... You're saying here? I have no choice. As I told you before, I'm a daughter of Cold Harbor. If I return to Tamriel... That increases Harkon's likelihood of bringing the tyranny of the sun to fruition. Uh, we might never, never come back for you, you know. After what I've put Serana through, I would understand if she never wished to see me again. I leave that decision in your hands. Surely it should be her decision. <laughs> Harkon is not to be trusted. No matter what he promises. He'll deceive you in order Why to do I happiness. decide wh whether she ever Promise sees her mother again? Keep my daughter safe. She's the only thing of value I have left. Because I'm the main character, that's why. I'm a protector. That doesn't mean that, that that doesn't mean that I I can decide whether she sees her. Oh, hello. Well, this is awkward. Her her mother again or not? That's 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 her decision. It's nothing to do with me. Stay your weapons. I would speak with you, Quinari. Um. Well, your voice sounds familiar. I thought you were dead. Cursed, not dead. Doomed to exist in this form for eternity. Where is she? I don't know. Yeah. Between Lars and Enoch. Between life and death. 
Hmm. Uh, didn't you just try and kill me? The hostility was necessary. I was bound to an oath. Oh, all right then. Oh, that's what's so crazy, isn't it? All right. So why are we talking now? I believe in civility among seasoned warriors, and I find your ear worthy of my words. My claws have rendered the flesh of innumerable foes, but I have never once been felled on the field of battle. Well, I therefore honor name you Quanarin, or Vanquisher in your tongue. Uh, I... Role-playing! I found you equally worthy, apparently. Your words do me great honor. My desire to speak with you was born from the result of our battle. A will? Wanarin. I merely wish to respectfully ask... Just kiss already. <laughs> Look at it, Favor. For countless years, I've roamed the Soul Cairn in unintended service to the ideal master. You get me three pieces of paper, that'd be kind of cool. Before this, I roamed the skies above Tamriel. I desire to return there. Well, I can't you do me a favor. <clears throat> What's stopping you? I fear that my time here has taken its toll upon me. I share a bond with this dreaded place. If I ventured far from the Soul Cairn, my strength would begin to wane until I was no more. Yeah, Casper, we'd probably all stay now, though, so how could I help? To get a huge, wide open boss area, you two. <laughs> I will place my name with you and grant you the right to call my name from Tamriel. Do me this simple honor, and I will fight at your side as your Graze Mazen, your ally, and teach you my thum. Just call your name in Tamriel, that's it? Trivial in your mind, perhaps. For me, it would mean a great deal. I don't require an answer, Quinarin. No. Simply speak my name to the heavens when you feel the time is right. There you go. We're, we've accepted. I mean, yeah, it is a good deal. Um. Hmm. Yeah, never gave me a loot. Uh, so, I mean, what? Why are we asking this? He's just explained that we vanquished him, so he calls us Vanquisher. But anyway. In my language, the Quanaran is the Vanquisher, the one who has bested a fellow Dova in battle. Yeah. Uh, fellow Dova? But I'm not a dragon. Even in the Soul Cairn, the defeat of the World Eater has reached my ears, Dova King. Huh. You may not be Dova, but the defeat of Alduin earns you the right of title. But, that's kind of clever, because we have finished the main game, obviously, but we're not forced to, have we? We could have come, uh, you know, here straight away, couldn't we? We read it on Dragon Facebook. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of cool. So I wonder what he says otherwise. Maybe... You're always the Dragonborn, though, right? So maybe he'll just be like, oh, well, I know you're the Dragonborn, so therefore, you know, yeah, you're the Dragonborn, but he no he knows you've killed Alduin. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, so that all that kind of stuff, I'm really, I, I'm really, like, big thumbs up, supported with. Yeah, I, I like that at all. I like that a lot. It also, you know, isn't necessary, because Dragonborn would have done. Um, you know, that that is the reason. But the fact that they added the Alduin thing is 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 nice. A so real attention to detail, which you know, it's kind of a rarity. Uh, <clears throat> so how do you end up with the Shulker? Okay. There was a time when I called Tamriel my home, but those days have long since passed. <laughs> yes, Ladosh, or um, something a bit ruder. Skies, vying for their small slices of territory that resulted in immense and ultimately fatal battles. 
And were you part of all that? I was. But unlike some of my brethren, I sought solutions outside the norm in order to maintain my superiority. I began to explore what the Dova call Elok Dilan, the ancient forbidden art that you call necromancy. Oh, a necromantic dragon. That's really cool. So you sought the soul cane for answers. The ideal masters assured me that my powers would be unmatched. That I could raise legions of the undead. Hmm. In return, I was to serve them as a keeper until the death of the one who calls herself Valerica. They didn't tell you she was immortal, lol. I discovered too late that the ideal masters favored deception over honor and had no intention of releasing me from my binding. They had control of my mind, but fortunately they couldn't possess my soul. And that's why you're free now. Free? No. I have been here too long, Panarin. The soul caring has become a part of what I am. I can never fully call Tamriel my home again. Or I would surely perish. But I oh. only hope that you will allow me the precious moments of time there through your call. That's really nice. It's well written. Yeah, that's clever. I like that a lot. Mwah! Um <clears throat> I will, I will, I will. I mean probably probably in this stream I imagine. Depends how it goes, but we're gonna we're gonna head back now, right? It's this way. We got some good loot. Yeah, it was. It is ultimately just empty, though, isn't it? With a bunch of like random bits and bobs that uh, that you can do, but I mean, meh, right? Oh, there's a thing over there, though. I'm distracted. Huh. Yeah, it's not much of a. Oh, I've done this one. Not much of a vacation, is it? It's like, well, yeah, you can't really take any fights, any any side slugs. I need you to kill these dudes. But that'll be a nice thing to surprise some enemies with, right? Good evening, Cold Hat. Welcome in. How are you doing? Oh, Grumpus has got a new outfit. Let's check it out. Oh. He's got a helmet on. He's got new, uh, new braces. New booties. Still got his vampire armor on. Which is... Yeah, take it or leave it. Integrated in the soul here, apart from dragon. We met the uh, Jib. We met Jib. He had a fetched quest for us, uh, which we um, have not done. So yeah, that's that's what you're getting at, right? <laughs> and it was cool. It was cool. But um, yeah, this area is too. Big and you know, just a little, little too. I'm just not feeling it. <clears throat> yeah, that's cool, cool heart. Thank you for that. Appreciate it. 
But um, yeah, we got seven out of ten of, of his of his journal bits, and this is literally the only chance I have now to go and get the rest. Um, but it is it is too boring. <laughs> like even no, no, they made it a fetch quest. No, not doing it. Where are you anyway? Where's where's uh, where's our girlfriend? Yeah, it looks like you can actually get in there again if you wanted to. Didn't expect that. All right, so charity live stream. This doesn't seem right, going all the way back. For the last, for the last three hours, I'll go back into the soul can and find those those pieces of paper. That's how we're going to round out the, the, the stream this year. Um, <clears throat> 24 hours on, I think, the 8th. Um, Okay. Yeah, we, we do have to go all the way back through. That's unusual. No mods at all, Cold Killer. Um, Cold Heart. No mods. Um, in the slightest. This is, this is about as generic and vanilla as you can possibly get. Not even Special Edition Skyrim. Where the hell am I going? Oh, wait. There is a balcony. Okay, bagels, thanks. That you can use this path travel with. I completely missed it. Let me go and check it out. All right, thank you, bagels. I think she bugged out of the government. Yeah, she she's just disappeared, hasn't she? She has disappeared. Well, I didn't do anything weird. This balcony. Oh, it was locked before. Well, it still is. Hang on. I mean, should we, um... I reload? <clears throat> Maybe, like, travel... here again? She's gone. Yeah, she'll have to be there for some kind of conversation, though. Yeah, I'm... So I'm gonna have to run back. As far as I can tell. Yeah, 
Yeah, but I didn't like I wasn't I wasn't dicking around during that conversation. So I don't I don't know why it broke. Oh, you can pass travel from the balcony. Oh, I see what you mean. Right, I thought... Yeah, okay, I get it. Well, I'm not going back there now. We'll, 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 we've come this far. <laughs> or should I? Maybe I should. Yeah, that, now I know what you mean. I thought it was like an in-game mechanic you were referring to. You know, about there's some teleporters on the balcony. That's what I thought you meant. I'm not used to, um... I really should have taken that route though, shouldn't I? Although... This is the main big fight. The in game, yeah, I, I, yeah, I know, but. <clears throat> Surely they couldn't, yeah, they, they intend you to go this way though, don't they? I, I know what you. We can draw from, from here, but. We... Yes, 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 yes. Because this is outside as well, isn't it? Hey, hello. Uh, do you need something? Uh, uh, does it bother you that we're working with your father? I figured it would be more of an issue for you. Why? Don't tell me you're that naive. Really? Oh, mm -hmm. wow. All right, well, what do you think my father's going to do once we bring the bow to him? Reward us. <clears throat> Celebrate our victory. And I thought my father was the delusional one. <laughs> At that point, you'll have given him everything he's ever wanted. He won't need either of us anymore. You think he'll try and kill us? You'll have shown yourself to be strong, which means you can't be allowed to just stick around. And I'll be unnecessary once he has it. Yeah, I know, Photo, but equally, you know, the, the fact that the, the, the fast travel can be used to in that way, uh, it's kind of silly. Um, what do we do? I think you know. We both know what's going to have to happen once we find the bow. Keep strong and eyes open. We're on a different path now. Hmm. So. Where's our buddy? Not that one. Not really. What? Where is it? Um, was it a shout? Storm call. Was a frost breath. Not disarm or that. Oh, there he is. Why can't I? Oh, I don't have a dragon soul. Oh, that's fine. I don't have a dragon soul. Okay. 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 Okay, I get it. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, fine. <clears throat> yeah, I didn't think it'd be grayed out. I got nine souls. Okay. Oh, right, so I gotta... Got to use R to unlock it, right? Okay. Yes. Okay. Let's go the whole way, right? Are ready? Oh. 
But that wasn't very good. <laughs> um. Point at the ground. It's a bit weird. It's, it seems to be, yeah. It seems to be a bit weird. Why would you point it at the... I guess because he comes out of the ground because he's undead? Okay. Enjoy. Oh God. I now teach you the first word of soul. The essence of your enemy's life I kind of already have, okay. I kind of already did that. You having fun? I mean, he's got nothing to fight, but he's having fun, right? <laughs> Majestic. Beautiful. It lasts quite a long time. Chasing eagles. He's, he's having conversations and stuff. Okay, well, great. Um, we got a dragon. We got a pet dragon. Sorry, now. We got a pet dragon. Pet undead dragon. Oh, I see. You're not following me again. Fine. Share the castle and call parrot an undead dragon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Where is everyone? I have. Leave me in peace. Oh, hi! <clears throat> you should have been following me the whole time. All right, doggy's fine. Doggy is fine. Do not worry about the papa. Yeah, the papa. Oh, papa. Hated and feared, as well I should be. There's some things I want to ask you about. You have earned my trust, so I will share what I can. Um. Uh, uh, when you greeted Serena, it sounded like you hadn't. Oh, hello. Uh, <laughs> seen her in a long time. Serana and her mother disappeared long ago. I come out the breathing again. In the court to look for them. But after centuries of searching without success, I lost hope. In my heart, I know that it was my wife, Valerica, who took my beloved daughter away from me. It's true. If I ever see her again, she will pay most dearly for that betrayal. What else do you want to know? Uh, so, um, uh, you mentioned her mother. You know what happened to her? Mm, at all, maybe? Mm. Her name was Valerica. Still is. She has been gone for so long now, I can only assume she has left this world one way. I will say only that we did not part on good terms. Well. What else do you want to know? No, that's fine. Um. Very well. <laughs> um. The dog's fine. Leave the dog alone. Oh, poor doggy. 
All right, where am I going? Where, where? Thank you. Thank you, dog. Thank you, dog. Ah. Yes. How may I serve you, my lord? Um, what do most priests do exactly? I guess that's that's an appropriate question for Grumpus. It is our sacred duty to study the Elder Scrolls. We read these ancient scrolls of prophecy in yeah, order I enslaved to find him. the future, yep. and we use that knowledge to aid the Emperor. Sometimes we venture out into the world in the search of more scrolls for our library at the White Gold Tower. That is the very purpose that first brought me to Skyrim. You love this game? Many people at the White Gold Tower? What on earth is that? Yeah, is quite is, is idling quite loudly? Yeah. Wait, oh hello. <laughs> okay. The White Gold Tower you set. Oh, oh no, I'm getting pushed again. Are we good? No! <laughs> I need to sit down, my feet hurt. Okay. It is the great spire at the heart of the Imperial City, among the tallest towers in all of Tamriel. The lower floors are home to the Imperial Council, and the Order of Moth Priests... No, it's because he's read the Elder Scroll, isn't it? So it's made him blind. The tower suffered damage in the recent war with the Altmeri Dominion. Temporarily, perhaps? It once was. I hope one day to see it restored to its former glory. We'll ask him. Uh, what do you know about the Elder Scrolls? Not as much as I would like. Even after spending decades of my life in study of the Elder Scrolls, they remain a great mystery to me. It's true for most of my brothers in the Order as Need well. a shot for a second one. We don't really know where the scrolls came from or who wrote them. What we do know is that some are born with the special gift to read the Elder Scrolls. These chosen <laughs> few can divine events of the past and future within the scrolls. <laughs> Though in time, it drives us to blindness. <laughs> I'm afraid there's there not much more to tell. Even today, the Elder Scrolls remain a great enigma. Why are they a great enigma? There's freaking loads of them around. <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> I brought you the Elder What are the Elder Scrolls? I'm afraid I won't be able to help you with the scrolls. We do, moment. we do. I would not even. Please, do not be angry with me. What are you talking about? I'm afraid in my haste to read the first scroll. I neglected the time I needed to prepare. The failure is purely mine to bear. As you can see from my bandages, it's not that I am unwilling. It's that I am physically unable. You're blind! Oh, please, my lord. Please, forgive me. Then you die. I don't suppose there's a cure. If only such a miracle existed, I'd overcome the impossible in order to secure it, if it meant pleasing you. Then we have no further need of you. Although I would gladly die by your hand, perhaps I could offer an alternative way to read the scrolls. All right. Oh, thank you, my lord. Thank you. Let's get to it. <laughs> Scattered across Tamriel are secluded locations known only as Ancestor Glades. There's one in Skyrim in the Pine Forest. Performing the ritual of the Ancestor Moth within the Glade should provide the answers you seek. Explain this ritual. It involves carefully removing the bark from a canticle tree, which will in turn attract ancestor moths to you. Once enough of the moths are following, they'll provide you with the second sight needed to decipher the scrolls. Ancestor Glades is your D and D character. Uh, carefully gather the bark. How? Well, we've got a dog. <laughs> Sorry. In keeping with tradition, you must use a specific tool in the Ancestor Glade, an implement known as a draw knife. Every moth priest is taught this ritual, but few ever get the chance to perform it. You should consider yourself fortunate if it works for you. I get the feeling it will. Do I need to read the scrolls in any particular order? My question would be, what if I go blind? <laughs> That's the thing that I would be worried about. Not, not, do I have to read them in a particular order? But, you know, you are blind by reading one of them, and we've got two of them left. 
So, like, that's that would be my concern. Hello, Jonathan. How you doing? Yeah, should I read them in chronological or release order? <laughs> they skip the first season. Let's find out. From what I saw in the vision, the Elder Scroll which foreshadows the defiance of the gods with the blood of mortals is the key to the prophecy. So is it is it particularly uh, normal for uh, Moth Priest to go blind? Sadly, yes. It is the inevitable fate we agree to pursue when reading the Elder Scrolls. It generally does not occur until a Moth Priest is in his latter years, but in my case, I simply was not preparing myself properly. Oops, what went wrong? How are you doing, Jonathan? Hope you've had a good Monday. What went wrong? Deciphering one of the Elder Scrolls is nothing like reading a simple book. There is quite a bit of ritual and concentration required. It can take months or even years to complete a single scroll, and even then, months to recover. I see. So, whoops. So how's a moth? Oh, no. <laughs> Related to the Elder Scrolls. <laughs> like, I'm going to leave here now. <laughs> well, as I'm sure you figured out by now, <laughs> it's no mere coincidence that we're named Moth Priests. The voice of the Ancestor Moth has always been an integral part of reading the Elder Scrolls. But Moths barely make a sound, yet alone speak. You can't blind you if you're already blind from the boost of blinding speed! You know you're right. Oh, the moths don't literally read the scrolls, but they maintain a connection to ancient magic that allows the moth priests to decipher them. Oh. If you listen closely when you find the glade, you should be able to hear their song, a soft, harmonious trilling. Drum it's spot. through this ancestral chorus that the moths tap into a form of primal auger and become a conduit for deciphering the scrolls. How does that help the Moth Priest? By having the Ancestor Moths close to the Moth Priest, they can utilize the conduit and share the Moth's augury. Only the most resilient of priests can do it this way. It takes years of practice to interpret the harmony. But you'll think I'll be able to do it? How do I even stand a chance? This answer is going to be quite interesting. You've come this far. <laughs> and you found several Elder Scrolls. Yeah. Whether you believe it or not, the scrolls have a mind of their own. If they did not want you to find them, oh, no. they would not allow it. Because of this, I strongly believe you were meant to hear the ancestral chorus. Only one way to find out. The the the, the, the Elder Scrolls have chosen Grumpus Go Smash Face. They've He's the chosen one. Of all the people of Tamriel, Grumpus Gross Bashface is the chosen one. Not only is he the Dragonborn, but he's the one who the Elder Scrolls have decided. Yeah, okay, that's him. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing how one guy or girl has so many unique abilities that nobody else would be able to do? That's, inc that's incredible, right? I think it would make more sense, right? If I was to just like, you know, if I was, if I was just, just had any influence in this in the, in the writing room, why don't we make her be the one who can read them? Because she was locked in with one for freaking millennia, for a long time. So she, that's kind of a unique thing, right? That she has just been, um, you know, she might have like bonded with them a little bit, right? They've got used to her presence and therefore that would replace the years of training because she's, you know, if they're sentient, she's been kind of around them. So whether she knew it or not, they're used to her presence and therefore that would kind of work in, in, in this moth song thing that they were talking about. That would make a lot more sense to me rather than just, oh, well, you're special. But hey, we're the main character, so we can do everything, right? Yes, me too. Me too. Yeah. <clears throat> Argument for Grumpus? Meh. Sorry, Shadowhawk. I just don't, you know, I, I, I just like other characters doing stuff. 
and they, they, I, I, I have enjoyed this this little interplay between Serena and her, her mother and her father. I think that's that's been pretty good. I've enjoyed that. Um, but uh, yeah, yeah, I just, I just, I just don't like the well, you're special thing, but for no reason, right? They've just chosen you. I just don't like it. I just don't. I just, I just, I, I just find it pretty weak. You know, the, the Serena one would, would make more sense. <clears throat> well, no, Photo, because test books aren't sentient, are they? <clears throat> uh, lots of people complain how Oblivion, you were chosen one's best friend instead of having the agency of your own, so I can see why they... Yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, I know, I'm only giving my my um take on things which of course will will likely differ from the masses who want to be the chosen one because you know you're you're special <clears throat> the god's chose grumpus out of convenience he's done enough to push um in the right direction you're right yeah 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 that's that's what it is. All right, I think we'll leave it there for tonight. Um, I've enjoyed it. <laughs> Sorry you're coming a bit late, Grump um, Jonathan. But uh, yeah, I think that's a good that's a good stopping point. Um, and I'll be back tomorrow um, to do more, hopefully for longer. Just today, I wanted to get some jobs out of the way. I didn't nap. Um, So, so I'm getting a bit tired. So sorry, level seven injury. I, 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 I apologize. I gotta stop somewhere, though, right? You know, even if, even if I stream for another two hours, there'll be someone who who came in at the end of that. So, it's a shame, but it's the way it is. <clears throat> You're welcome. <laughs> Whatever I read the textbook, get this thing feeling it hates me. Maybe, maybe. Um. All right. So if you're watching the VOD, cheers very much and uh, see you next time.